of time! It's a hand on the Oh, thank God! It's the God that can deliver the soul from sin and death! So, Mr. Speaker, have you just come down from Crookie Back Mountain? It's a bunch of losers! You can't save the black man! You come from hell! Learn something. It's the Bible's clear. How are you going to be saved, Four. man? <laughs> hey, you got to hell, man. Because that's where you saved? come from. Through <laughs> faith. It is the gift of God. Lest <laughs> we perish. There's no greater gift. Thank you. There's no greater gift than folks. God's good news. This is your bad news. Read it. Read this and live. Live by trust. Live by God's love. Or live by your own truth. Young man, what is your truth? Where'd you get that hat? Yeah. I didn't ask that. What is your truth? Definitely not this. Well, he doesn't know, but all he knows is it's not this. Do you know where you are? Yes. Do you know who you are? Listening to a lunatic in speaker's corner. Do you know God's grace is upon you right now? Did you read the Bible? Do you know God's grace? It's not memory from the Bible if you read it so much. Do you know that by grace, he sees some babies being killed in the Bible. Do you think you're a sinner? 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 You are a sinner. I mean, you are a sinner. I should get up on there and speak. So you know, sin comes from the Bible. No, it comes from the Bible. That's not the Bible. World? No, the Bible is the only place the scene is mentioned. Wake up! Excuse me, sir, we're finished. Did you read this many times? Oh, yeah. I'm here if it just be for you. I read it too, and I know that if you would have read it, you wouldn't be here. What did you read? <laughs> the New Testament, the Old Testament. What did you read that made any sense? Nothing at all. <laughs> just a minute, one lunatic at a time. Excuse me, is this a personal Not consultation? I didn't say the church. What did you read in the Bible that you would disagree with? Everything, even the title. Name one. You see, this is numb society. I don't know. I, I read it, but I can't tell you anything. Why? Because self is so important. I have you love yourself so much. You can't even get past yourself to understand you are your biggest problem. You are a problem. You read the Bible, but you come here and you impose your opinion on others. I impose my opinion on you? Just a minute. Folks, just a minute. Barabbas! Barabbas! Bring on Barabbas! We Barabbas. want Barabbas! Keep going! We want Barabbas! This is my choir! No! You're going to hell! You you're going say to hell. you're a it's sinner! It's Australia! <laughs> you believe you're a sinner? Life is fun here if you're a sinner! Is it? Yeah! Is abortion fun? Yes. Amazing! I mean, they're right to have that Killing a baby is fun! Is that the baby is a fetus? No, it's not! It's not real! You don't have a pussy! Would you you don't come to right to the side! I'm not Mr. Speaker, uh, you talking about abortion, did your parents at least discuss Folks, we contraception? we have problems here. This will take many weeks to help. This man doesn't have a pussy. You believe he can decide for us? Jesus Christ can change the heart. Stop here, have a pussy, and I will hear you. Isn't it sad? Have a fucking pussy. This is a poor, demented soul that needs God's grace. China! She believes she's it's okay to kill baby, but yeah. she wants to have sense to know sin is the, the killer of all. Are you sinless, man? All have sin, man. So let you sin, man. man. What's your sin, man? Has he got any video evidence but Jesus Christ is the savior, man, of sin. Are you man. sinless, man? What's your sin, man? <laughs> My Are sin. You, you take drugs, don't you, dude? <laughs> My sin is repentance. Drinking, drinking. That's the answer. You're all like drinkers. Sir, I'm not here Georgie, to listen to you. You're here to hear me. Yes, I know, that's it, man. 
be you patient. You hear one way, you don't talk, you talk, you don't listen. That's I just, problem. would you shut up, I just I got here. I can't shut up, you shut up. I, lost I just got here, here. give me a chance. On a Sunday, you see folks. folks? Yeah, why aren't you in church? Without Jesus Christ and his loving kindness, all you got is, I'll kill a baby if I want. Of course I can. Oh, I can kill. On. I can that, do whatever that is I want. not my just an unfair characterization. No, rules. it's not yours. My pussy, my rules. God rules above you. My no, he doesn't. Rules. God will judge. No, he doesn't. Rules. There's no one above God parliament. God will judge. <laughs> I don't care if you're a king oh, know you don't or a care. little girl. <laughs> you have no sense, no sense of passion. God is the ultimate judge of our actions. Jesus is alive on his tribes. Jesus Christ came to take away the judgment of sin. If you want to say your body you rule, that is just a monotonous bunch of insanity. You spell monotonous. Now folks, Jesus Christ, he died to take away our sins. What was his real name? He died for all who would call upon his name. Which tribe did he belong to? Jesus said, ask and it shall be given unto you he belongs to the according Jesus, to his will. I mean, that, that is the cheapest Not I've according seen to in your will. Time. You've got your own mind. You uh, think really you're, you're your own God. I mean, no, but it's a little G. Little G gods, is they're the sin everywhere. Is the sin wash out? Little G gods think they're the, big the G gods. Off? But you want to know something? Jesus as Savior of us. The Bible says there is a way that seems right. You think you can sit there and think you're right, but your Creator has a way. Our world is falling apart because of these kind of people. Listen, you've got a lot of problems. I can only deal with a few today. Every single time you open your mouth, another problem. Thank you. If I'm your problem, let me see you walk away. Because it's very funny. No, you're here because you want to be here. Cowboy, this you don't want to be here. This is free. But folks, God. Grace is See, wonderful. You keep using this word God. His, which peace, peace, God is his talking rest. About. He but wants to give it to us, but when we indulge in me, 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 yeah. Me, 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 me. Why, why don't you clean oh, my I windows or me. shut up? He says he's I love high. myself he so much. He comes down here. God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son that whosoever keep going would believe in him would not perish but have everlasting life. But when you say me, me, me. Oh, I love you. Me. You do that oh, so well. This is, this is it disqualifies you. It disqualifies you for the love of God. Why not take a look? You put yourself. You put yourself in the judgment of God instead of the mercy of God. God's love is so great. Folks. That someone loves so you. wonderful. That God would change a soul, would change a heart. One soul, one heart at a time. Why is he speaking so slow? God would give us his grace and mercy. We joke about it because it's strange. Why does he just put it on YouTube work and we'll, God we'll, we'll look at it? To forgive. And we want to say, if you're really real God, prove it. Prove it. How you prove he exists? If you wanted to know, I don't think you do. I want to know. Are you sure? Yeah. Are you positive? Can I ask your name? Abby. Abby. 
Abby wants to know if God exists. Is Abby sincere or is Abby a liar? I'm always sincere. I like to learn. That's very good. Well, you just said you'd like to know. Don't, don't negate it. Now, would you be willing to do whatever God says to do? I don't hear anything. Just Silence and listen God. You need to learn how to listen before you talk. I know you've got a hard problem on your hand, but I think I can help her. Now, Abby, it's true. First, I just want to help him just a minute. Sir, run! Okay. I know he's not taking my advice, but you know it's true. Abby, 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 I was just joking. Calm down. He's not running. My gosh, he's holding on to you. Now, Abby, you say you want to meet the living God if he exists. Are you willing to abide by God's way to meet him? Or do you say no? I won't do whatever God says I need to do to meet him. If I can hear him, if he would talk to me right now. Oh, so Abby's got ifs. So the living God wants to bow down to Abby. I'm so why is God better than that? Why is God better than that? I mean, if I don't hear God, why is God I better than you? Because he created right. you. You go away, think about that for about five weeks, and then come back. Okay, I'm a dad, but I don't feel like I'm it. It's going to take you a long time, man. <laughs> Abby's way up on you. Now listen, you know you went up when you met her, right? You excelled. She decreased when she met you. But you want to tell you something. Both of you can increase when you meet Jesus. Because the two can become one Why in Christ. So Why Would you so shut up? Arrogant? I'm preaching. <laughs> Why is the guy so fucking arrogant? No. He always judges. Really, does he? He loves you. He loves us. You, he 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 doesn't judge. Wait, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Just a minute. Whoa. Wait a minute. My fucking grandmother. So, if God, just let let's take a little God test here. If God to you is real, is does he know better than you no. or not? No. No. So how can he be God? Does he love the kids in How could God be God if he doesn't know better than you? Obviously, you are pretty deceived, but we already knew that. Now, just, just a minute. Now, have you ever been to jail? Do you want to go to jail? No. Why not? Why would I go there? <laughs> you, have you ever done anything wrong? No. Well, shut up, I'm talking to him. Yes, yes, yes. I just did. Now you shut up. No. I just shut up. I liked you a minute ago to Abby. Be quiet. Abby, Abby, chill, Abby, chill, chill, it's too late, I already did, thank you, obviously I'm not going to shut up, no, do you, do you want God to damn you, do you want God to damn you, yes or no, we don't care, no, then worship him, then worship God through his son Jesus Christ if you don't want to be damned. Jesus came to take your damnation from you if you choose it. But if you choose yourself, we will be damned. I did, but you didn't listen. Go buy the CD and put it on flow. Can you understand simply that if God has no greater wisdom than you, then God doesn't exist to you? Yes, it doesn't exist to me, but like, why Jesus came and he was equal to ask you this. Why Jesus was equal to everybody and God was above everybody? Do you think Prince Charles exists? No. <laughs> <laughs> On that one, I don't blame you. But 
That makes you a human. You know man. what? Do you think the Queen of England exists? Yeah. <laughs> She's still smarter than you. <laughs> you see, when you think of any authority, do you think the police exist? Yeah. You're getting stupider, Abby. <laughs> I mean, it's going like this now. Sir, you might be equal pretty quick. You see, you know that the police exist and they have authority over you. No, no, no. They're equal to me. They're human. Just a minute. I'm not done. I'm not done. God forbid if you ever marry. No. You're never going to have the last word. You know it. Now listen. Getting funner, isn't it? Now listen. Remember, we're at Speaker's Corner. I'm the speaker. You're the squeaker. Now, when you consider the police and when when you have done something you know is against the law, the police are then qualified to cause you to be arrested. You say no? No. Are you a Muslim? Yes. He says no, the police aren't over it. There's a problem here. There's a problem that your niblets will not help. The digestives are not helping you. I would suggest dark chocolate instead of milk. If my breath stinks, you must enjoy it. You're right there smelling more of it. Now, folks, we have here two extroverts. I'm an introvert. We have extroverts. I don't know, go look it up in a dictionary. Now listen, one more wonker. Now listen, if the police are uh, over us, when we... Turn down the volume, it's on your left shoulder. Now listen, when we do wrong against the law, the police are needed. If someone kills your dear Abby, by the way, that was, never mind, dear Abby, if someone kills Abby, murders them, would you go to the police or just walk away and find another Abby? No, yeah. There's no other Abby! Oh, oh. There's no other Abby! Yes, there is. There's plenty of you. She's not. I'm asking him, though, please be quiet and let him try to be, with all his might, intelligent. Go ahead. Okay, I will go to the police. Oh, you go to the police. Why? Why you can't help me? No, no, Abby, you're dead. Be quiet. Just a minute. <laughs> Remember, you died, and he's just carrying this out. Just a minute, Abby. Too. Eat some more niblets. Police are here to help you, not to be above people. So they're going to help you catch the murderer. All of a sudden, the police are worthy of your attention. But if you do something wrong, get away. It's okay. You see, God is over the police, but you would say God doesn't exist because you say God wants to judge you. There's something going on in here. Should start to click in together right now. The puzzle should be fitting about now, but I dare say I don't think so. You see, folks, we are not a law unto ourselves. That's the problem with the world. So, what happened to Syria? What happened to Syria? What happened to Germany? What happened to Egypt that, that a church just exploded and 25 dead? What happened to Russia? What happened to Germany? What happened here? When they run over a bunch of innocent people. But let me ask you this. Is there anybody innocent? Are you innocent? I am. Are we innocent? Are we innocent? Are we innocent? Would you please? Would you please shut up? No, I won't shut up. What have done this? Just a minute. I hereby give Abby. 
the permission to speak while I speak. Go ahead. Now, folks, when you and I think we're innocent, we think we've done nothing wrong worthy of any type of judgment. Yet, our world is falling apart. People killing people. Muslims killing Muslims. Catholics killing Catholics. Catholics killing Catholics. Are you Catholic? No, it don't mean it's fucking God. I didn't no. even take the communion. Isn't it amazing? The person that would curse God says she doesn't believe in God. Yet God believes in her. Because he died for her sin. What great love, Abby. You're missing out on just the love of this God. You're missing out. You're a, because you're because Abby is plastic. Plastic Abby. She's a fake happy. Abby's only happy if Abby gets what Abby wants. So does Abby get whatever Abby wants all the time? Liar, liar. If we were on a game show, you'd be off. Because you lied, Abby. You know. She's booing herself. That's good. She's getting back. Uh, you now, the folks, without Jesus Christ, you cannot Man, cure you your sin. It's not in us. Really? Who told you? No one told me I have sin. That's your problem. Your problem is internal. So you're deceived. You're deceived thinking at a 15 or 14 year old that you. You're 19. You're going to grow up gracefully, probably in your age. If you'd stop eating all that chocolate. Chocolate is the devil. Two words for you, young lady high cholesterol. No. Jesus died for our sin. Jesus died to give us rest inside the soul. Yeah, I'm rested inside my soul because Jesus gave it to me. So, so Did he? Do you believe in Jesus? No. I believe that there is something. There's something. All right. You believe that there's something. Wow, that's really deep belief. There's something. <laughs> do you believe? Do you want me to believe in an old man with a white beard? No, not Santa Claus. I hope you gave up Santa or Father Christmas a while ago. But I, I, doubt, I doubt it. He probably has given you the niblets. Now listen. Now listen. You believe there's something, right? So, do you believe in evolution? Wait a minute, you said, you said no, no. You are in England now and they pronounce it evolution. And I believe it's evil, Lucia. Very evil. No, just Abby. Abby. Is a what? Who told you it's factual? Science. Science told you. Wait a minute. Who's science? Hey, was there a voice behind that? What? What? I thought so. Never mind. That's usually what happens. Just a minute. We're down. So you believe evolution is factual? No. Can I ask you a question? Since you don't believe evolution is by faith, right? Is evolution by faith? No, it's only by fact, right? So, can you explain to Abby and Abby's hopeful and Abby number two and the rest of the crowd factually how evolution began? Big Bang Theory. No. No. Do you know what? 
Listen, you know why? You know why? Because factually, Listen. you don't know. That is a fact. I can't explain because the fact is that you believe in a bunch of people called scientists. Everyone can be. Actually, yes. So you have some online. Everyone. Now, sir, if you believe in evolution, I, I believe we have someone that can help you today. I really do. I think he's stepping up for you. He's feeling bold today. I say, sir, what is your name? What? Ayub. Ayub. Nice to meet you, Ayub. Are you looking for a boyfriend? Ayub, do you believe in evolution like I'm not sure what his name is? I believe of conscious evolution, but not the evolution of Darwin. The conscience evolution. So you believe that this world and everything in it and the creation of man all happened by chance. No, it happened by the creator. Well then that's not evolution. Ayub. What's your name, sir? Steve. Very simple. Ayub, am I pronouncing that right? Okay. Now, Ayub, have you ever met anyone in your life like Abby? <laughs> you have. Most of the people that are like Abby are very, very conscious of their ego. Like Abby. Right? Yes. That's rude. That's very rude. It's very true. She agreed. Yes, but I speak the truth. You would. You you sit there and say you're rude. She didn't. You're offended at nothing. Grow up. Sir, sir, you want to talk? Do you believe Jesus Christ? Do you believe Jesus Christ is your savior? No. Jesus Christ died for your sins. Jesus, sir, Jesus died for your sins and Abby. I wasn't even born when he died. False. Ayub. Ayub would say false. Ayub would say false. And Ayub, who died for your sins? Nobody. Nobody. So Ayub will spend eternity in hell because nobody will take his sins Abby got taller, but still she's not tall enough. I'm taller than you. Now, can you can you put him on? Now, folks, without Jesus Christ, you just try to become taller. Without Jesus Christ, we cannot have our sins forgiven. It doesn't matter how many nose rings you have or earrings. It doesn't matter how you're trying to look on the outward. A cowboy suit. Doesn't matter. It's about what Jesus can do on the inward Abbey, on the inward Abbey's mate. It's all about the love of God that can change what you and I cannot change. There is such a love because I've got something to shout about. I've got something to shout about, and his name is Jesus. You may, you ask a question. I believe God is one God, the Father, Son, and Holy. Holy Spirit, the one God. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, which is inside man and outside of the body. Are you? Have you ever read Genesis chapter 1? I've not only read it, I've studied it and watched it. Are you? Are you? When God created Adam in Genesis chapter 1, and heaven, verse 26, and, and God is called Elohim. Do you know what Elohim means? What? You don't. That's your problem. It is the plurality of God. God said, let us 
Elohim, make God in our image. It wasn't just Let me review them one, one person. Of the God, the Father, Father, Son, the Holy Spirit, Allah 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 Spirit Allah created Abbey, you God is one of the love of creation of God. Without Jesus Christ, you have lost. What about Torah? Do you believe in the Torah? No? The Torah is... Wait, the Torah. The Christians believe in the Torah. The Torah is the Torah. Don't believe in the Torah. I just quoted. Islam believes in the Torah. I just quoted you the Torah. Are you Genesis 1, 26? And God said, let us make man in our image. Why man and not women? Below him. Because man was created for men. Then from my balls were created first. Have you read the Bible? <laughs> poor, poor Abby. Abby won Canada. What Bible? Come from women. What Bible? Do you all come from women. God what Bible? loves Abby and the Jew, and He sent His Son, Jesus Christ, from, from the beginning. He prepared forgiveness for those 